It's just such a great intro. I think it very accurately conveys what this game is about. You know, it starts off, you've got Link riding through, riding through the twilight. Darkness is settling upon the land. But it also, I also think it does a pretty good job of conveying, like, a sense of emptiness that Hyrule is experiencing. Hey, hey, how's it going? Welcome in, Fox. How are you, my friend? Hope you're doing well. Um, I... I can see fine, but it looks pretty dark on my stream, so let me, um... Let me see if I can mess with these settings and try to brighten things up for you guys so that way you can actually see a little bit doing it going to bed soon but I figured I'd stop in briefly well I appreciate that um why does it have to be on game mode I don't want it on game mode settings general external device manager It's not going to come through for you guys, is it? Uh, I'm stupid. I'm stupid. Why would that work? Yeah, it looks a little dark. Um, can I? Properties. this up. Let me look this up. Change brightness OBS. Ah, I'm not the only person. First first OBS thread I pull up. I am super new to streaming and using OBS, so part of my really dumb questions. Also, I'm not very tech savvy, so a step-by-step -step guide would be great. I have had a few complaints of the image being too dark while playing Zelda. That's me. Um, okay. So, color space back to partial. Where, where do I get the color space? actual OBS settings. filter adjust the taste so I should be able to just do filters audio video filters effects what if you mess with brightness game on the source for the capture specifically through, B through OBS yeah that's what I'm looking for Uh, 
is that is that better? Does that look too bright? I upped it a little bit. I mean, it looks a lot brighter, I think. It's just weird because it's, I think it's really only with Zelda because I'm trying to remember what game I was playing the other day. Elden Ring, maybe? I think it was Elden Ring. Okay, it looks good. I don't remember, but there was a game I was playing the other day that I was streaming, and it was like the exact opposite. That It was much darker on my TV than it was through OBS. So like I would look at OBS. It was Half-Life. It was Half-Life, because I looked at OBS to get through parts, because I couldn't see it in Half-Life. Alright, where are we? I had problems with this when I was testing Dragon Quest VIII for PS2. Elden, yeah, we're in Elden. Okay, so not Ordon. Elden. Elden Province. Well, I've got to I've gotta get into the weeds with some of the stuff, Fox, because um, I know I briefly mentioned uh, something about a game room. Like, just in passing in a couple streams. Um, I'm working on getting a game room set up in my basement, and I actually have a green screen set up down there. So, I know I've got, you know, work to do with getting all that set up. Just different technical things. So, I'm excited about that. Ooh, what do we got? It's the hero sword. Sniff it! It's the wooden training sword that he ran off with. You learned the youth scent. See, isn't being a wolf more convenient? Now use X to hone your senses. You've begun to reawaken as a wolf, I think. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually pretty excited about that. I was messing with it the other day, and I did get it up and going. Um, looked good. I did a lot of work down there. I'm excited to show everything once I get it all up. There are still a few other things I'd like to get, but... You know, those will, those will just come over time. Like, I don't have, like... I don't have, like, the stream lights. Like, the... You know, the LED lighting and that kind of stuff. But that's alright. It's not necessarily important stuff. Like, it's not make or break the stream kind of stuff. Just ambiance. What's this? That's strange. The bridge is gone. I wonder if this is the work of those shadow creatures. Ugh. What a pain. Oh well. Let's look for it. You. Get your map out. I know where it's at, Midna. I already know. The yellow area marks where we are. You knew that, right? Whenever you destroy those creatures from the darkness, a portal ma opens that looks like this on the map. You hear me? It's called a portal. You better remember that. Uh, I'm very familiar with how to use a portal. Thank you. And in those woods we came through. Yes, it's got to be around there. I'll use my power to take you to the location of the open portal. Pick where you want to go. Uh, you know, I just had the the realization that... Um, I don't remember if it's north or south. I guess I'll figure it out. That... Shoot, what did you have before this? Wind Waker and Ocarina of Time both, like, you had to use music to do your fast traveling. LED lights do look nice, though. Mine are fine. They just look weird. See, I told you we're here. You know, most people can't leave the twilight that easily. You better be grateful. It's your job to look for the bridge. Look hard. Um. Hey, Midna. I found it. It's a bridge. What do you want me to do with it? Oh, I just didn't walk 15 feet over to it. My bad. Sorry. Wow, it's perfect, don't you think? What do you think? Should we take it? Good little obedient wolf. Yeah, it's weird they moved away from music for teleporting after Wind Waker. I guess I don't... I, I haven't played through Skyward Sword to n to remember that Midna, are you okay? That was quite the grunt. 
quite the grunt. Like, my goodness. I mean, then, yeah, you have, you have, uh, like, Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom, I understand, just because of how many more fast travel points there are. And I guess that might be part of what what they did here. Skyward Sword just had the Sky World as a connecting point. You can just be whisked away to different teleport spots on the map with Fee. Gotcha. Gotcha. But even like... Because what? Wind Waker, it wasn't like you went to specific spots, right? You just played the song and then it would like give you different places you could go to. See, just as I thought. So, isn't the power of Twilight amazing? Call me if you need the power again. It should help you find what we're looking for, don't you think? All right, let's keep going. So I'm I'm just gonna assume that's that's what it was is that they they started to get so many more points that music just didn't really make a lot of sense. But I do miss it. I do miss having to learn all the different songs to go to all the different places. Or, I mean, even like Majora's Mask, like, you still at least had to play, you know, the, the song to get the owl to come whisk you away. Yes, we're gonna get on the fence. Huh. What are they doing there? This is a pretty elaborate gate. What are they trying to keep in? Or out? I bet it'll be worth our while to dig in. Well, yeah. Alright, that's it for me. Good luck with the game. Thanks for stopping by, Fox. I appreciate it. Hope you uh, actually get all set up for your new job tomorrow. But thanks again for stopping by. Hope you have a good night. Fingers crossed for me, yes. Fingers crossed. Have a good one, Fox. Kakariko Village. Gotta take him down in groups. Autumn. To the hero who was transformed into a blue-eyed beast in the realm of shadows and twilight. This way. But I don't want to go that way. I want to go the other way. I am a spirit of light. Hero chosen by the gods. Look for my light. Gather the light stolen by the shadows into this. The vessel of light. Let's get some tears of light. The insects of darkness. They are the form taken by the evil that attached itself to my scattered light. In this shadowy twilight, the shadow insects are invisible, much as the people from your light world are. With the last of my power, let me mark your map with the locations of the tears that have turned into shadow insects. But be careful, the darkness now hunts you. Well then, let's get them! Nice. <sighs> Excuse me, let's go whoop him. Hey, you can climb up here. Whee!
It's the children. Cripes, I don't see those. Cripes, I don't see those black brutes anywhere. They gotta be hiding somewhere waiting for their helpless little prey to come out. Then they'll feast. We are safe as long as we remain in here, child. Be at ease. Oh, yeah? I wonder if the monsters out there agree with you. They sure didn't seem impressed by my bombs. How long do you think we can hold this sanctuary against the beast that strong, huh? Once they attack, it's over. Remember the lady from the general store? Just one of those things attacked her and a whole gang from town went to save her. And what happened? She was already gone and there were two monsters waiting. You connecting the dots? That means if we get attacked by them, then we'll be... Barnes! Look, Renato, all I mean to say is that it's risky here, too. Ain't you got some place we can hide? There is a, a cellar. <laughs> what? You got a cellar? Where's the entrance, man? The entrance to the cellar is designed to open when all of the candles have been lit. I would not do that. When father instructed me to secure the cellar, I saw insects like the beast outside. Don't cry, Peth. It'll be okay. Link is coming to save us all. I can feel it. That's right. Link to the rescue. These kids knew you'd come to save them. What a hero. How sad to be right in front of someone and not to be noticed at all. <laughs> you are chosen by the gods, and only, that, and only that keeps you from turning into a spirit, or worse, into a dark monster when you enter twilight. And no one knows what you have done. You may be doomed to toil in obscurity forever. You are the type to worry about everything, I can tell. But don't fret over Princess Zelda. She chose the state of affairs, after all. Anyway, what's with having to light candles? To get to the basement. Not very subtle, is it? So, what are you gonna do now, my lonely little hero? <laughs> As things are now, it is likely safest for us to remain here. Cripe, seems like everyone's trying to pull a fast one these days. Boy, I don't have a clue who this Link fella is, but I've got to say, I ain't overly confident he's going to come save this village. Oh. Oh. Jump. 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 One more. Aha! Okay, we already read that, so I'm not going to read it again. What sorcery is this? The entrance to the cellar opening on its own. Could those beasts have even engineered even this? Well, a beast of sorts did, yes. But not the ones you're referring to. Get them bugs, Link. We don't need no bugs. Yeah, 
And away we go. How about that? Looks like you can climb the scaffolding. Well, let's go. Ooh. We're in the graveyard. Got him. Bye, bug. Stop it. Where are you? Stop it. I'm just so wolf. Walking through town with this little imp girl on my back. She's all right, I guess. Get out of here. Get out of here. Nobody likes you. Go away. So we gotta get in this shop. Somehow. There we go. It's a secret tunnel. How did you get here so fast? I like how he growls whenever you get ready to when you target somebody. He is on the prowl, ready to attack. I dig it. We got five down, we got three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven more to go. Leaped over that with relative ease, I must say. Alright, let's go. Let's go, Jimmy. Easy peasy. Down, bug. That's what I thought you said. I'm assuming it's some kind of hotel. Oh, we gotta figure out how to. Where's the fire? Gotta 
find some fire and light it. So that way we can spook Le Boog out. I'll smoke the bug out is the real answer, not, not spook him out. There we go. Got him! I'm just trying to get out, okay? Don't worry about me. What other shops have radio in radioactive insects in them? bomb shot maybe sorry Barnes I'm breaking into your shop through your dilapidated window See a little sparkly, sparkly bug. A little electric death bug. <laughs> All right. Well, in we go. In we go. I actually have to go in. Okay. Huh? What did you do? Sorry, but as romantic as this is, I'm not going to stay here with you. I'm getting out. if you wait longer if you get better rupees but I'm already maxed out so it doesn't matter sorry Barnes your store surplus did not survive hmm. I don't suppose there's any nicer way to hunt these things huh well you had to sacrifice someone's house to find tears of light but that's how the cookie crumbles right All right, we gotta find five more. Aww. Oh, that was lame. So I gotta climb back up through the house. It's not that way. We need to go this way. There we go. Whee! Get down with your air. 
here and then let's get out of here. At least as far as I know, I'm done with my errand. I think that's the only one in that building. Nope. Four more! Oh, we gotta go back up. Bogus, man. What's the matter, buddy? You're doing all right. You're doing all right, big guy. Yeah, you say no, I'm not. Change your mind. Uh, I do not have it. Up the hill. jump. What a jump by this amazing canine. Let's dig. Let's dig. I dig it. for. Nice. Well, I'm assuming if I had any more use for in here, then they would uh, just give me like a jump point. But I did not see one. Fall damage, nice. Thanks, a beast. I mean, literally, because he's a wolf, but outside of that, he's literally a beast. Ooh. Looks like the past is impassable. But I can get up to it if you want. Nice. Oh, why do I have to stand guard? The ladder is destroyed, so it's not like any humans will come up. And what is with the elders? If we have a problem with the humans can help with, we should ask. It is better than suffering for the sake of our pride. No doubt about that, dude. Excuse me, thank you. Chomp, chomp. I know, dude. Minda could have helped there, but, you know, she said, nah. Forget that. Ooh, yes! Yes! Where the fuck did you go, bug?
Oh my goodness. Thank you, Link. Finally. We get to learn another sword skill. I'm excited. so much. dogs howling at the moon let teachings of old pass to you take sword in hand and find me So that's uh, back in the beginning. We still got some work to do as Wolf Link first, though. Or we wanna even want to think about that. So we got two more tears of light to get. So spooky like. Oh, there's a fourth one. Dang it. I got bamboozled. That's alright. I'll be bamboozled no more. You will not bamboozle me more than more than once. Cannot bamboozle me forever. Now you've just been boozled. Oh my, excuse me. Nope, can't go that way, okay. It's way back to the entrance. Oh, sorry, I didn't go up on the ledge. Uh, wait a second, have they tucked me out of the way because they think I am useless? No, I'm scared of the monsters. Out of here, big bird. Oh, gotcha. Hey, pal, you almost pushed me off, man. I 
thought I had one. Oh my gosh. I'm in the hot springs. Well, I was in the hot springs. Or maybe they're not the hot springs yet. Okay. Can't do anything with that for now. We'll come back. to another fumarole, roll and once again it is the worst possible place I suppose this path is impassable now what do you say if I were to go back down that way I would get knocked back in an instant I am sure of it my legs were as strong as the elder's legs, I might be able to stomp my way down there. Sounds to me like you said, well, I'm a wimp, so I can't do it. got bamboozled. We got bamboozled. The vessel of light is full of tears, and the light has returned to this area. What you, Mike? Aww. I was just starting to have fun. Don't forget that few shadow. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Oh, I kind of want to do this dungeon tonight. We'll see. Let's see how long it takes us to get there. I may just get to that and save it so we've got a good starting point for the next time. <laughs> Big Bird! Is that a bat? My name is Elden. I am one of the light spirits of Hyrule. I am the spirit that guards these lands. O oh, great hero chosen by the gods. The dark power you seek lies in the sacred grounds of the proud mountain dwellers. But already those grounds have been defiled, draped in shadow and seeded with evil. You must go to those sacred grounds and cleanse them.
Um, I know what I have to do, I just don't remember how to do it. I guess we'll figure that out as we go, right? It's my boy Link. Link? Ah, uh, see, Beth, I told you Link would save us. You are the one from Ordon whom these children spoke of? We are well met. I am Renato, shaman of this town. And this... This is my daughter, Luda. The beast took us and left us to die, but Mr. Renato found us. At first I couldn't believe they had come from so, so distant a place as the Ordona province. Yeah, I... We don't remember much. All of a sudden everyone was captured and then... To now, it's been like a nightmare. Yeah, it was like a terrible dream, and we couldn't wake up. Mm. Nightmares are everywhere these days, it seems. This village has certainly seen its share of recent hardships. The dark beasts attacked, but even worse was the sudden and inexplicable change in the mountain dwelling Goron tribe. They had long been our friends, but suddenly treated us as foes. Even now, they refuse to permit us entry into their minds. It strains the limits of belief to think that such a gentle and proud tribe could change so suddenly. It makes me wonder if something in those minds is the cause of this change. In any case, you must take these children and flee this village before more nightmares descend. I, of course, cannot leave my village in such a time. There is no telling what may happen to us here. But it is my job to try to coax the Gorons back from their recent change of heart. What do you want, kids? I'm not your dad. I'm not your uncle. I don't want to leave all these people just to save ourselves. Come on, Link, can't you do something? Isn't there some way to make up with the Gorons? you think someone could go to the mines and do something. Uh, Link, trying to go near the mines is very dangerous. I will be very sad to be separated from Colin and the others, but I know they must go. Please return them safely to their parents. I do not know what is in the Goron minds, but surely they will soon come to understand it and right what is wrong. Do not concern yourself with me, my son. You must flee this place as quickly as you can. Look, I don't even know it's here to, ne to know that I need to flee it. Oops, I chopped it. Chopped it in half. Okay, that's empty for now. <laughs> L in a hundred rupees per night includes continental breakfast, fame, natural hot spring, free. <laughs> What hot spring? Not even anybody here. What are you talking about? No one is home. It's 
go see if uh, Barnes will give us some bombs yet or no. Cripes, my storehouse, my, my powder, what happened? Them, them foul beasts, curse them all. Can't even get any if we wanted to. Well, this was that question ish. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Anything? Anything useful? Probably not, because it's all blown up. here. So we'll go see. Oh goodness, excuse me. Well, there's some kind of chest and heart piece. Surely not. A purple rupee that I don't need. I appreciate that they do this. Well, I guess we're just going to go up. Up on the roof. What do we see? Anything of interest? I don't think so. All right, back down we go. Let's go check out. I'm pretty sure I have to just get like tossed. Okay, it's starting to come back to me. No humans allowed. These lands of Ahud belong to the Goron tribe. The elder said no humans may pass. Yep, 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 yep. A weak spirit is no match for the might of the Gorons. Do you understand me, human? Then away with you. I gotcha, I gotcha. This is also where we're going to learn our next sword move, too. Okay. It's all coming back to me now. It's all rattling around the old noggin. Ah, how fortunate you are in one piece. I saw you heading up the mountain trail, so I was worried. Are you trying to reach the Gorons on Death, of Death Mountain? It is far too dangerous, Link. They recognize only strength. A normal person could never persuade them. But I do know one person who was able to best them and earn their trust. His name is Bo. You may know him as the mayor of your hometown, Ordon. Please go to him. And while you are there, please let him know that the children are safe. Of course, getting them back would be best, but we could not keep them safe from the monsters on the road without a horse and cart. Please, return to Ordon and inform the parents that their children are free from harm. Give them my word. All right. 
Let's see, can I just warp now? Sounds like a few shadow is something somewhere up that mountain. So all I can do is what climb. Do I don't know what that Goron's problem is, but you better come up with a way to get up that mountain and quick. Okay, so we can't fast travel. Oh yeah, this scene. Here we go. Okay, it's not the one I thought it was. There's our horse. Hold on, Link, don't fall off. Woo, we got her. We got her, folks. Too shabby a wrangler after all. Won't this make getting back to your town a lot easier? Now go finish your errand so we can get back. Get a move on. Epona is back, folks. Like I know I'm gonna be all old man yells at Cloud here, but I just want to say that like, Mr. Link, wait. <laughs> Greetings, Mr. Link. I have come to deliver a letter. It is a letter from Oko. <laughs> I love when he does that so much. <laughs> well, my business is concluded. Onward to mail. <laughs> All right, what's what's our letter say? We just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. And it's from Oko. Dear Adventurer, I was so happy to meet you and spend a bit of time with you. I am planning a trip to a new location just so you know. If you continue your journeys, we might see each other again. So take care of yourself. P.S. I didn't have a chance to tell you this last time, but I have a son. I'll introduce you if we meet again. He's a good boy who can help you like an item, so be nice. But like when I when I think of you know let me old man yells at cloud for a second here when I think of what do Link and Epona look like like what is the look this is it this is signature Link on a horse right here like 100% don't get me wrong I am I am not saying I don't like the you know the champion outfit or whatever that's what Nintendo has put Link in uh, on Breath of the Wild. I just think this is like the classic, classic Link look. But obviously very well done in 3 And in some cases very well done in HD too. Grand Theft Epona running people over. Next one, next one, okay. Next one. Yeah. Back to Ordon. Well, of course we would have made it to Ordon. Ordon's the first village. What 
do we get? Do we get the seal shield bash now? We meet again. You have a little more of the look of a hero than you did before. Do you feel ready to earn your next skill? Very well, but before we begin, I must test you to ensure that you have mastered the last skill I taught you. The ending blow. Now then, come at me. Yeah, we got it. Excellent. It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well, my second skill is the shield attack. Let it be hewn into your mind. Shield attack, shield attack. Gonna smack you with the shield attack. No matter how well tempered a blade is, if a foe is clad in armor and bears a shield, the sword will do it no harm. When facing such a show such a foe, you must use R to thrust your shield against the defenses of your enemy, causing the fiend to recoil. Use L to lock on to me, then try it. You have learned so much, so I am sure you can see the moment when you can do a shield attack. <laughs> what? Excellent. Open a hole in your enemy's defenses and use your sword to strike without hesitation. The shield attack I have just taught you can also be used to repel an enemy's projectile attacks. Would you practice? Then repel my magical attack with your shield attack. I missed. Perfect. When your enemies assail you with projectiles, this is how you will defeat them with ease. Done, you have learned the second of my hidden skills, the shield attack. Oh, it just looks so cool. Looks so cool when he does that move. Oh, excuse me. But, I have five more secrets to teach you, in time. The path to becoming the true hero is a long one, but once you have grasped all of the hidden skills, you shall be worthy of walking it. You must persist on the lonely path of the sword to obtain true courage and earn the strength to conquer the great evils of the world. Do not forget your discipline with the blade before we meet again. <laughs> Alright, we got it. We got a new attack. Let's go get an item. Let's go. Mayor. Mayor Bo. What's up, Bo? I see you. Link? Whoa, oh, it is you, Link. You're safe and sound. Your clothes. What happened to you, lad? C come quick, inside. I see, so the youngins are safe in Kakariko Village. Well, that's good. Renato is an old friend. If they're in his care, then we can relax. So, don't keep me waiting, lad. Tell me of my little girl. Ilya is with the rest of them, right? Oh, I see. That ain't what I wanted to hear. Ah, uh, but Link, I guess I need to think of all five of those poor kids, not just my own. They're all in danger. What I should be asking is, how can I help out? Well, it just so happens. What's that now? 
The Gorons of Death Mountain. I see. So Renato told you that. Well, it's true. I did defeat the Gorons in a contest of strength and earned their trust. With the help of a little secret. I can teach you the secret, but can you promise me that you will absolutely, positively, will not disclose it to anyone? Of course. Good. Alrighty then. Absolutely no one. Come this way. I think you've heard of sumo wrestling, right? Gorons like to match strength in sumo contests. Luckily for you, the basics of sumo are the same as stop and charge and goats. You want to hear more? Sure, we'll get a refresher. Alrighty then, I'll teach you the basics of the ways of sumo. If you're getting into a sumo match, chances are you're, you're in an arena like this. The first fellow to push his foe outside the arena wins. Step forward and grab your foe with A. Use B to let a retreating foe taste your open palm. Sidestep a foe's advance with left and right. Three techniques, all of them pretty basic. Master all three and you'll be shoving folks out of the arena in no time, lad. So there you go, the basics of sumo. Need to hear them again? Nope, I think we're good. Rather than explain a lot, why don't we just get into it? Come into the ring, lad. I love this visual, too. Not this one. But Link. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Get him. Get him, Link. Get him, get him. Get him. Shove him. Out he goes, yeah. Got him. Got him. <laughs> you seem to understand the basics. Alrighty, next time I won't go easy on you, lad. Fight me as if you were fighting one of the Gorons. Push back. Oh no, he's slapping me. He's slapping me. Push him. Push him. Push him. Oh, he got me. No. Oh, he got me. He sidestepped. Oh no. Oh, man. Yeah, push him. Oh, no. No, no. Yeah, shove him back. Shove him. Yeah, slap him and push him out. There we go. Got him. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, well, not too shabby, lad. With your natural talent, I'm sure you can take on the Gorons. You've gotten a slight, a sight stronger in the short time you've been gone, Link. Strong as you are, though, you can't hope to beat the Gorons wrestling with power alone. Those Gorons are made of rock. Now, the secret to beating the Gorons is locked away in that chest. Take it with you, lad. Iron boots! You can probably tell those boots are made from iron, lad. Whoever wears them won't be easily pushed around, even by a Goron. If you're fixing to fight a Goron, be sure to wear those boots. Let's be square, though, lad. You can't tell ever tell anyone about those boots, especially Renato. All right, cool. Thanks, man. Cool. Thanks. Bye. Iron boots. Let's walk real slow.
Somehow I don't step right through the bridge here. Must be some strong iron. Or some strong wood. Excuse me. Alright, let's go get Epona back. I think we're gonna get just back into, uh, what you call it, Elden. I think I'm gonna save it there tonight, folks. I'm a little worn out, but that's that's a, my fault. I stayed up till 3 o'clock in the morning reorganizing all my Pokemon cards, and I am paying for it tonight. I can feel it. I can feel it. Alright, let's go, Epona. This way, bud. No, this way. Let's go, horsey. Yeah. Good horse, though. Good horsey. Let's go back out on the high road. I should get bonus points for running these dudes over, right? No, this way. We must follow the path. Tired. I'm just running into walls. But again, that's a me problem. I hear a bug. Get him! Get him, Link! Get him! To do our first bridge duel. Let's go! Let him get away. <laughs> Let's go. I ain't scared of your dudes. Weak sauce. All of them.
Yeah, go pick thing. Get up. Get up. Oh, get up, Link. Why did you stop? Get him. There we go. There we go. Fight me, you coward. Big pig. Piggy piggy. Oh, we missed it. Come on, Pigamus. Got him. Survive the ride another day. No. I saw that coming. Saw that coming from a mile away with that one. Just took too long to get going. Try this. Oh, get out of here. He did not hit me. He did not hit me. That's a lie. It's a lie I got around him. There we go. Get out of here. Get out of here. Got it. Oh, it's so good. What a shot. Oh, it's so good. Freaking amazing. The set pieces in this game are so good. Link. Is everyone okay? I'm sorry, you know, for, for shoving you. Are you mad? I, I think I finally understand. I understand what my dad meant when he told me I needed to be stronger like you, Link. Link. <laughs> 
He wasn't talking about strength like lifting stuff. He was talking about being brave. Link, you saved me, didn't you? You... You can do anything. You can do something to help the Gorons in the mine too, can't you, Link? Let's go. We gotta make sure he's okay. Let's go check on him, and then we're gonna... Oh, it's gonna spring. There we go, back to full health. Nice. Nice! Where'd they go? Well, I guess they're not in there. Okay. They run off without me. I can't believe Colin. I mean, that was a really brave thing for him to do, huh? Especially since he's such a weakling. Um, he is gonna be alright, right? And Mallow, he hasn't even come by to say get well soon. What's he thinking? He said he was gonna get, get started and he hasn't come out of that closed up shop since. Link, could you talk some sense into that kid? Let's go talk to him. Huh? Hey, you can look at stuff, but don't you dare just take things. That's my valuable merchandise. You want it, you pay for it. I decided to take on this unmanned shop. Buy something, it helps the whole village when you do. Ooh, we got a legit shield now. We got the Hylian shield. I see. I suppose I can part with it. Let's go. Maybe I can't become a hero, but I figure I can help people out with heroic business deals. You better work hard, too. Heroic business deals, indeed. I dig it. I dig it. Hang on, we gotta equip it. We gotta equip it. Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! We just gotta get the Master Sword, dude, and we'll be set. Absolutely set. Alright, folks. I'm gonna save it right here, and I think we're gonna call it a night. A little bit shorter stream tonight, but that's alright. We'll do a longer one on Friday. I just wanted to make sure I actually got some streaming in tonight. But we're at a good we're at a good stopping point, I think. So let's uh let's swap back over here. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. you all are having a good night. I am going to try to get a good night's rest tonight, I think. I've been staying up a little bit these last few days or so. 
you know, being home. I've tried not to stay up, like, super late, but I think I was up too late last night. Uh, we might stay up for a little bit with a bunch of rain. But we'll see. I stayed up to watch Monday Night Football as the Rams, or not the Rams, my goodness, not the Rams, as the Ravens just obliterated the Buccaneers. As a Ravens fan, I was very happy about that. Oh, I missed one. The Ravens obliterated the Buccaneers, and that made me happy. There you go. There's a good one. Um, and then I stayed up to sort my Pokemon cards. I started sorting my Pokemon cards about halfway through that game. And then just the way I was sorting them initially took... I lost a lot of time on that. I figured I optimized it by the time I got done with it, but it literally took me like four hours. So I just took out, watched the football game, then watched the end of the other Monday night game, and then I just watched some, uh, watched some HMJ. So let me actually, let me, at the HMJ, let's see if that actually registers right. Yeah. Pretty cool guy. Pretty chill streams. He was playing a quiet place. Played some, uh, what else did he play? He played, uh, the Liar's Bar, I think it was what it was called, which was a very interesting game. It was all about, it was a bunch of bluff games. Those are fun. Those are fun. But, uh, let's see who's live that we can raid right now. far ahead. Let's, uh... I don't think I want the same category, though. Let's see who's playing time. We'll check this one out. Vesper Crest 98? Maybe. Let's see. I'm always nervous trying to find somebody new. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. 
I think I dig this. I think we're gonna go watch this. Uh, we're gonna raid. We're gonna raid Russell Dew. This dude is playing. <laughs> I don't know if it's a. I don't know if it's a ROM hack or if it's just a. What? But he's playing. He's playing Ocarina of Time. But it's not Ocarina of Time. It's actually Super Mario 64. And I just think that's neat. So we're gonna watch that. So let's uh let's get this thing started. I appreciate you guys hanging out. Um, I'll be back live Friday, same time, 10 o'clock. We'll uh we'll fight. We'll we'll do the Goron Dungeon Friday. Uh, we'll do we'll do all that fun stuff. And so we're gonna we're gonna get on out of here. Thanks again for hanging out, guys. I appreciate it so 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 much. Um, of course, I'll drop my socials again if you wanna if you wanna follow me on YouTube, watch a bunch of VODs there, or if you want to uh, interact with me on Twitter, uh, that's where I am most often. Um, so let's get out of here. I'm going to call it a night. Let's get this raid going, and I will see you guys in the next one. Adios. Oh my god! Oh my god!